Now that we have flipped the calendar to January, people all across the Chippewa Valley are working on those New Year's resolutions. News 18 Sam Farista joins us live now to tell us more about how people in the Chippewa Valley are hoping to start the year strong. Sam? That's right, Katie. I went to downtown Eau Claire last week looking for people to share their goals for the new year, and this is what they had to say. My friend just reminded me that I wanted, I said that I wanted to stop worrying so much, so just letting things go is, is really something that I'm going to work on. Definitely be part of my community, um, attend my AAs, and uh, possibly form new groups, um, something that works for people other than uh, something with uh, professionals. I was uh, doing a news resolution for uh, losing weight. I started last year and I've lost almost 100 pounds total weight. At, uh, I love I love enjoying outdoors, getting out walking all the time. I always make a resolution to be more thankful and grateful and just to do more healthy kinds of habits. Most people I spoke to said they haven't thought of a New Year's resolution yet, but luckily we're just getting started with the year, so there's still time to think about goals, achievements, and resolutions. And that goes for you, Katie. Have you thought of anything that you're planning to do for the new year? Um, A little bit. I think definitely increasing, like, but are increasing um, water intake and definitely I need to spend less time on my phone, especially right before bed. What about you, Sam? Um, I, I'm, I'm with the majority. I haven't really given it a lot of thought yeah. um, either as well. <laughs> I would say the one that I would definitely try to do is I yeah. want to read more. I got a few books okay. for Christmas that I want to get working on. So. Okay. Yeah, we'll talk about books. I love reading. All right. Awesome. Thank <laughs> Thanks, Sam. Well, according to Statistica, the saving money is the top New Year's resolution for Americans in 2024.